Hi, it's Titi here from My Sacred Blood. In this video, I want to share with you some of the reasons why I made the switch to reusable menstrual cups. So I have mentioned before in previous videos that my go-to product for menstrual care is sea sponges. And I still do use them. I still do use the reusable pads as well. And of course, whenever I use any insertable, I always use a reusable liner. But lately, for the last few cycles, I've been using menstrual cups, especially for the first few days or the first two or three days of my period when my flow is a little heavier. During the last two days of my period, or when the period starts to taper off and my flow is a little lighter, I will use the sponge. And then I'll also use sponge for things like exercising or when I'm cycling because it's just a little bit more comfortable and I don't feel it at all. Overnight, it's exclusively pads. The Diva Cup is still my cup of choice. I have it in both sizes, the size 1 and 2. I had the size 2 first because I have been pregnant, I have had child, but then I got the size 1 because I found that size 2 was a little bit bigger for me. Here are some of the reasons why I switched to menstrual cups. First, it really does take between 8 to 12 hours till the cup is filled to capacity. And second, I don't have to worry about carrying around a wet bag full of used pads. And third, and this is in the case of sponges, I don't have to exit the bathroom stall when I'm out in public to secretly rinse the sponge and then re-enter the stall to reinsert. And then of course I don't have to be on the lookout for people who might be entering and exiting the public bathroom. Which brings me to the main reason why I switched to using the reusable cup. And that is using the cup in a public restroom is easy as one, two, three. All you have to do is one, wash your hands or your wipes before entering the washroom stall. This is something that you should be doing whenever possible, whenever you can, if you are on your period, whether you're using reusables or not. Number two is remove and empty the cup. And three, wipe clean. You can use reusable wipes if it is practical for you and you can still carry those around in your wet bag. But of course, disposable wipes in public is best and it is a lot easier to deal with. The best part is, even if you don't have wipes available, if the cup that you're using is made of quality material, then you should be able to wipe it clean using regular bathroom tissue. And that's why I made the switch. Will you make the switch? I do hope that helps. I will see you in another video.